The Bay of Quinte Remedial Action Plan is restoring the environmental integrity and the long-term viability of the Bay of Quinte ecosystem. In the early 1990s, environmental damage that had been occurring to the Bay of Quinte for decades was identified and documented in a remedial action plan. This plan identified the environmental challenges that threatened the Bay of Quinte ecosystem and people's use and enjoyment of the Bay. Those environmental challenges were grouped together and called beneficial use impairments. The Bay of Quinte has 10 beneficial use impairments and the remedial action plan implements actions to address them. One of the main environmental issues with the Bay has always been the amount of nutrients entering it, particularly phosphorus. Phosphorus is a naturally occurring element essential to all life. In just the right amount, it's a beneficial, life-giving nutrient for rivers, lakes, bays and streams. On the other hand, too much phosphorus plays havoc with nature. In aquatic ecosystems like the Bay of Quinte, the ability of phosphorus to promote rapid growth causes problems. It takes only one pound of phosphorus to grow 500 pounds of algae. This nutrient enrichment process is known as eutrophication, and it's a classic example of too much of a good thing. We have been working to reduce the amount of phosphorus entering the bay from multiple sources, both rural and urban, such as sewage treatment plants, stormwater runoff, and agricultural land practices. With the reduction in phosphorus levels, water clarity has improved due to reduced algae, making the bay one of the most picturesque spots in Lake Ontario. Underwater plants have regrown, providing fish with habitat, helping to increase the varieties of fish in the bay. Phosphorus levels are still a major concern since they impact the whole ecosystem and people's enjoyment of it. A phosphorus management strategy is being developed to outline best practices for dealing with phosphorus issues in the future. Remember, healthy bay, healthy community.